I'm so excited. My birthday is in four days. One, two, three, four on Friday. I don't have to work. And I'll be getting paid, so I'm probably going to go out and get really drunk or go out to the club or um, I might be a loser and stay at home and see how many people don't care about me or call me for my birthday. It's like now. But um, I'm going to definitely go out and have some fun this weekend because I'm turning the big two, four. My God, I'm almost halfway to 50. What am I going to do? I don't know. I'm excited, though. Too bad it's not really allowed to do around here, or else I'd have something really huge planned for my birthday, but, eh, what can you say? The sun decided to make an appearance this morning, but it's still windy as hell, and I don't want to go to work. Uh. <laughs> Alright, well, as you can see, I'm dressed from head to toe. I was on webcam this morning taking naughty pictures for my friend. If you're watching this special friend, you know who you are. Let me know when you get the pictures. Because I got yours and they're great. Speaking of naughty pictures, um, I don't know why is there such a bad aura with sending friends or buddies or boyfriends or whatever naughty pictures over the internet. I mean, I know there's the whole thing of, oh, what if they get mad at you and send them to somebody else, but there's nothing wrong with it. I take lots of webcam pictures and videos and send them to people that I want to see them. Um, if they pass them around, hey, maybe I'll get famous one day, but, you know, it's not like I'm planning on trying out for American Idol or anything like that where if something surfaced on the internet. I'd be kicked off the show. And I was watching Flavor of Love, like, reruns of the old episodes. And you know how you kicked a bunch of those girls off the show for being, like, porn stars and stuff like that? Like, hello, you're on national TV doing all your wild business on national TV. Does it really matter if they're a porn star or not? Like, Flav, do you really care? Honestly, if I were you, I'd be trying to get the first chick that I could because you don't have a lot of time left, son, and you have like 25 million kids, and you're ugly, and you're ugly, and you're old, and you're ugly. I mean, come on now. Beggars can't be choosers now, can we, please? Mm-mm. But, um, having one of my granny bras today because I was doing laundry yesterday, and I kind of forgot to finish, so all my sexy underwears are in the wash, but um, I'm going to go ahead and get off here, sit down and watch You Are Not the Father, today they've got these crazy ass teenagers whose mothers can't control them, ain't no way in hell, I'll be getting on national TV talking about, oh, <laughs> my 14 year old beats me, what, <laughs> no, more like I beat my 14 year old, let my child raise a hand, in no doubt they will be smacked from here to the middle of next century. No way my kid's gonna be beating my ass. I carried you for nine months and went through however many hours of labor to push you out and then spent all my money and free time trying to take care of you and make sure you had the best of everything you could possibly have. No way in hell you gonna be beating my ass. I brought you into this world and I'll take your ass out. But um yeah, I'm gonna go watch some more of these fast ass little girls. Sometimes I wish I could just reach through the T V screen and slap the shit out of them and their mothers. But um I should be back after work today. I might have something more interesting to talk about. My life's been pretty boring lately because I've been doing nothing but working and sleeping and hanging around the house. I haven't really been hanging out out lately. I'm kind of trying to keep my vow of not really talking to too many guys because, you know, I need to cleanse myself. I need to get from under the evil grasp the power of the D-I-C-K. But, um, yeah. I just said own um, like 50 times in the video. But I'm about to go, so I'll let you guys later. Peace.